Hello, you're welcome. How to solve this nice algebra equation solution from here? And what we have here, you can write this as x squared over 36 can be written as 6 times 6, that's 6 squared equals to also here we have 6 squared over x squared. The next step here, we cross multiply x squared times x squared. Then equals to also here we have six square times six square. Then from here, this follows when we have a times a is same thing as a square. Same thing multiplying, we can write it as x square or square equals to here also we have six square or square. And from here, we take the right hand side to the left hand side. And this becomes x square or square minus c square or square then equals to zero here. This follows when we have a square minus b square, which is the same thing as a plus b into brackets, then open brackets a minus b. That this here a same thing as x square and b. Same thing as 6 squared. That is, yeah, all we have follow this and becomes x squared plus 6 squared into brackets. Also, open brackets, x squared minus 6 squared, close brackets, then equals to 0 here. Then here we have, here we have two possible cases. The first one, x squared plus 6 squared equals to zero or we have x square minus six square equals to zero here then solving on this side this follows when we have a square plus b square which is same thing as a plus b i into brackets then open brackets a minus b i that is yeah all we have follow this and becomes x plus 6i into brackets, open bracket x minus 6i plus bracket equals to 0 here. Then we also have two possible cases that is x plus 6i equals to 0, or we have x minus 6i equals to 0 here. And on this side, this gives us x equals to minus 6i. Which is a complex solution here. And here we have x equals to 6i, which is also a complex solution here. Then solving from the second case here, which is x square minus 6 square equals to 0. This also follows when we have a square minus b square, which is the same thing as a plus b into brackets open bracket a minus b that is what we have here becomes x plus 6 into brackets then open bracket x minus 6 close brackets equals to 0 here then we have two possible cases as well x plus 6 equals to 0 or we have x minus 6 equals to 0 here then here we have x equals to minus 6, which is a resolution here. And here we have s equals to 6, which is also a resolution. At this altogether, we have four solutions in this problem. Two resolutions and two complex solutions. That is, when we write it out from here, we can say so we have the first value of x which is x1 from here x1 equals to 6 x2 equals to minus 6 the first two resolution and also we have x3 equals to 6i and x4 equals to minus 6i that is the two complex solutions making four solutions together.
then let's check here if this satisfies this given problem that is when x equals to 6 this equation becomes 6 square over 36 is it equals to 36 over also 6 square then 6 square 6 times 6 that's 36 over 36 is it equals to also 36 over 36 this is over 36 that's simply 1 which is equals to also 1 here which implies left hand side is equals to the right hand side then x equals to 6 here satisfy this given problem then also for x equals to minus 6 when we substitute here this becomes minus 6 or square over 36 is it equals to also 36 over minus 6 or squared then yeah minus 6 or square this minus square become plus and 6 square that's 36 then over also here we have 36 is it equals to here also we have 36 over minus 6 or square also 36 36 over 36 is 1, which is equal to also 1 here. Left hand side equals to the right hand side. Then, minus 6 as well satisfy this given problem. And also for 6i, when we substitute x equals to 6i, this equation becomes 6i all square over 36 is it equals to 36 over 6 i or squared and this square here affects 6 and i that is we have 6 squared times i square over 36 is it equals to also here we have 36 over 6 square times i square and 6 square that's 36 times you should note that i square is same thing as minus 1 so here we have times minus 1 over 36 is it equals to also here we have 36 over 6 square that's 36 times minus 1 then here 36 cancel each other we have minus 1 is it equals to also 36 cancel each other this remain 1 over minus 1 that is here we have minus 1 equals to 1 over minus 1 is also minus 1 left hand side equals to the right hand side then 6r also satisfy this given problem and next we substitute minus 6r then what we have here becomes minus 6r or square over 36 is it equals to also 36 over minus 6 i or square then here when we square minus it turn to plus then 6 square that's 36 i square that's minus 1 over 36 is it equals to here also we have 36 over minus square that's plus c square that's 36 times i square that's minus one yet yeah, the six cancelled each other we have minus one is it equals to also here the six cancel each other we have one over minus one this is minus one equals to also minus one here left hand side equals to the right hand side and therefore we conclude that Minus 6i also satisfies this given problem. And thank you for watching. Don't forget this step. Subscribe for more videos. Turn the notification bell on. Share this video with your thumbs up and put your comment. See you next lesson. Bye for now.